Japan court upholds ban on same-sex marriage but voices rights concern. A Tokyo court upheld a ban on same-sex marriage on Wednesday but said a lack of legal protection for same-sex families violated their human rights, a comment welcomed by plaintiffs as a step towards aligning Japan with other G7 nations. Japan is the only G7 nation that does not allow same-sex marriage, and its constitution defines marriage as based on the mutual consent of both sexes. Although Prime Minister Fumio Kishida's ruling party has revealed no plans yet to review the matter or propose changes, several senior members support same-sex marriage. In Wednesday's ruling, the Tokyo District Court said the ban was constitutional, but added that the absence of a legal system to protect same-sex families infringed their human rights. This is actually a fairly positive ruling, said Nabuhito Sawasaki, one of the lawyers involved in the case. While marriage remains between a man and a woman, and the ruling supported that, it also said that the current situation with no legal protections for same-sex families is not good, and suggested something must be done about it, he told Reuters. Japan does not permit same-sex couples to marry or inherit each other's assets, such as a shared home, and denies them parental rights to each other's children, while even hospital visits can be difficult. Though partnership certificates from municipalities cover about 60% of Japan's population, they do not give same-sex couples the same rights enjoyed by heterosexual couples. The Tokyo ruling promises to be influential as the capital has an outsized influence on the rest of Japan. It had been keenly awaited after hopes were raised by a 2021 ruling in the city of Sapporo that the ban was unconstitutional, although another decision in Osaka in June upheld the ban. The eight plaintiffs in the case said the ban contravened their human rights and demanded damages of 1 million yen, although the court rejected that. This is hard to accept, said Gon Matsunaka, head of the activist group Marriage for All Japan. Both heterosexual and same-sex couples should be able to benefit equally from the system of marriage, as everyone is equal under the law, he added. It, the ruling, clearly said that is not possible. Yet the recognition that same-sex families lack legal protections was a big step, he said.